Curran asks, how can you explain a satellite imagery showing real up-to-date locations? Uh, show it me and I'll explain it. There is no satellite in inverted commas imagery for the explanation I just gave. If it's claimed to be satellite imagery in a sky vacuum, then there is no such beast. As for high altitude imagery, yeah, we can achieve that as the public. We can achieve real-time transmission of data. I saw some anti-flat earther stick a VR headset in a car on his head as he sent up a real-time camera up on a balloon. Wowee. But in terms of in-space satellites, no, that's just a complete lie. Because they claim to be in an orbital motion that's derived from flat earth measurements in an area of volume that gas isn't filling in violation of the second law of thermodynamics. So there are no orbiting satellites giving us real-time data. As for what we do get, show it me and I'll have a look at it. I don't really understand how it proves anything. The assertion that would come alongside those satellites is orbital motion. And I can show how orbital motion starts with a measurement of a flat earth to infer it. And who inferred it? The church, the priests who took those measurements of a flat earth and then put them into an orbital motion by turning a flat measurement of a radial value into a spherical value to explain why certain lights do certain things at certain times. That's all it's for. That reification has moved forward into a notion that we have items falling around a ball earth measured with a flat plane in an area of volume that violates natural law where gas isn't filling. It's it's an absurd question to ask uh, to answer because we don't have that area to answer the question about images coming from. There are no images from outer space, full stop. 